Hello, and welcome to another episode of Small Engine Velocity, and this is Caesar with another video on how to use your scooter, or if you can use your scooter, and how much do you make using your scooter as a delivery service. She's inside. I'll be out in a little bit, I'm recording. I'll do a movie with you in a little bit. Let me finish this first, okay? Yeah, it, not a real movie, just a fake movie. Yeah, you didn't finish the race. Sorry, that's my brother's kids coming out and telling me uh, they want to do a movie with me. So anyways, let's get back to the subject. The Zuma had a problem when we did our del first delivery and that was the problem with pizza. And I just made a mistake. There's a pizza in here. So I don't know exactly how I'm gonna carry that one. This will not fit a pizza. The seat underneath definitely won't fit a pizza and there's no way I'm putting a pizza sideways or at an angle on the floorboard. So what did I do? I went ahead and put it in my lap and rode around with one hand to try to deliver and then there's a spider on my bike. <laughs> to deliver a pizza. So I think I've come up with a good solution for the pizza box. So that solution requires that I don't have this. So as quick as it's here, it's now gone. So with this being gone, let me go ahead and get to you the solution that I've come up with. But first, I wanted to let you know this is a small board channel. Go ahead and give it a like and subscribe. Uh, it's also motorcycles too. I've kind of crossed over into both worlds. If this is something you'd like to see again, go ahead and click on that bell so that you can be notified. And I also I wanted to announce that I also sell t-shirts and these products. Have you ever thought, how can I support the channel? Well, here, look. Small engine velocity orange socks. You can put it over your face as a mask. You put it on your feet. You don't put it on your feet and then put it on your face. And then I also have them in other colors like white. Da, 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 da. <laughs> I also have an assorted t-shirt with logos and other sites and things on there. I'll put a link in the description below. So let's go ahead and get moving towards the solution that we've come up with. So here's the solution I've come up with. Went ahead and uh, checked on the Postmates store and they had something, but it was expensive. So I went to Amazon and I found this. Looks like just an everyday backpack, right? Well, you're wrong. If you flip this flap up and you pull it out and then you flip this little piece on the inside down, and seal it across the top if you want to. What do you have? Well, let me show you. Da, 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 da. Look at this. It is the world's most fashionable backpack. It is a gigantic bag that has backpack, has straps on the top and the bottom, and it is thermal. So let's take a look inside this thing. First of all, it has very comfy backpack straps with uh, padding on it, and then padding to offset off your back for airflow on your back. It does have a top and bottom strap to buckle the, uh, the bag onto your back. A carry handle, reflective strips across the side, two little pockets on the side, and you could put uh, small engine velocity key tags if you want to hand something out. The top is Velcro shuttable. Uh, it is thermal. And then if you take a look on the bottom, it gets its rigidity. See? So you pull the bottom off to get it to collapse because it'll crumble. So you put this bottom piece down and it holds it in. Uh, you also have the option of separating with a shelf across to the side, or you can just leave it on the bottom for uh, additional support. So if you're worried if it's gonna get all smushed up or anything, it will stay on your back. And then once you get off your bike, you can take it off your back, carry it like this over to the front door, open it up and say, hey, look, here is, oh, careful. So when you walk up to the front door, you can be like, hey, look, here's the cool stuff. Just in case anyone watched my last video, you can fit a small child in here. See? Yeah. You can fit. No, no! <laughs> so the reason I needed to take the uh, box off the back is because if I'm going to wear this as a backpack, it's going to run into that back box. So um, the back box does have 
the platform still, so if I do want to reinstall it, it's easy. But like this, I think we're good. <laughs> okay, I, I keep getting interrupted making this video. So if you want to see what it looks like on my back while I'm riding, here you go. All right, well, this is my solution for the pizza problem and carrying stuff and getting it to the door. It's gonna have to come in and out of a container uh, closer to the destination so stuff will stay hotter and maybe I'll get better ratings. I don't know, I'm not really good with this delivery thing yet. So hopefully you guys enjoy. Hopefully uh, you'll stay tuned for the next video uh, when I uh, actually get to deliver with this bag on my back. Anyways, thank you for watching this large backpack on a Zuma, and I will see everybody in the next video.